I guess it started starts way back when, like all stories do, uh, once upon a time. In those days, they, they were simple. Anything you could get in the air, you could enter in a race. You could look at them and uh, get some idea of how they were going to fly. You wouldn't win, maybe, but you at least enter. You learned a lot from that. This was something new. Those, those people were pioneers. A lot of them put their lives on the line, and they were all good pilots and all competing against one another. I think flying's a challenge to, to be able to do it and to do it well. Speed's always been a challenge. Racing is is inherent in the nature of man. It's fun to win. We're competitive beasts. Hell of a lot better than second. Well, those were the days when aviation was proving itself. People came from all over, and there was something like 250,000 people. Did you ever see pictures of the stands at Cleveland? Unbelievable. They were huge. People were everywhere, in trees. That place was jammed. Little communities would set up their own little grandstands and have a picnic. Cliff understood why those people came to the races. There wasn't much else in the Depression to look at but airplanes, really. Anyone that says they're not afraid to fly, there's something wrong with them. They're, most of them are dead or they're going to be dead because you always got to have that fear there to, to keep you honest, to make you do what you know you ought to. I've known a lot of fearless flyers and a lot of them are around. more, much more than I gave.